All right, I just got the uh, version 10 update, and uh, this will be my first time using Enhanced Summon. I did just drive the car around for a bit, and dude, I am freaking blown away by the improvements in autopilot. The acceleration from a stop, it kept right up with the car in front of me. Several points where uh, the car would typically um, have trouble going through an intersection and wanting to change, wanting to go into the left lane instead of stay in the, rain, stay in the lane. It solved that. Um, it, um, it, it literally, it performed almost flawlessly. There was only one mistake that it made, um, but I am seeing massive improvements in autopilot. I'm on hardware three, I've confirmed it with Tesla. I don't know if that makes a difference, um, but I am blown away. So let's see how this uh, advanced summon works, or the enhanced summon, I guess they call it. Let's see. All right, so I'm still on the uh, old version of the software for whatever reason, so I'm going to... What do I do? All right, so I'm going to say... Whoa, what the hell is it trying to do? Uh, well, shit, let's just see what happens. There's a car out there. There it is, backing up. You know, we've all seen videos of this online, right? And uh, I'm just going to go ahead and tell you. Oh, please don't hit that curb. Woo! It is uh, pretty amazing to see your car doing this by itself. Uh, look, we, we know it's not perfect. But by God, it's doing a hell of a job right now. Looks like it almost hit that curb. <laughs> this is incredible. It's actually doing a pretty good job. I've seen people talking about it cutting through... Uh, parking space lines and whatnot well that's not the case here you better turn sharp there you go come to papa taco that's my car's name taco in case you are wondering dude that was freaking amazing seriously amazing that uh, i mean i mean just mind blown my freaking mind blown all right i'm gonna try to send it to another spot all right let's see how this works you know what i, I may need the uh, other version of the software to do this yeah i i don't think i have the right version of the software to go send it or maybe i do let's see Oh no, I, I can. I can I can move it. Let me let me change to the satellite view here. There we go. That's oh sorry, y'all aren't seeing a thing I'm doing, I'm sorry. I'm gonna send it right there. Sorry, this is really hard to do. So I'm gonna send it right there. Press and hold to start. So there, that's what it's trying to do. Let's see. That's what it looks like in the app. Turn, baby. Damn, she makes me nervous going around those... Uh, going around those curbs all right looks like she's kind of pausing check things out here it should take a hard whoa watch that curb all right there's the dude i i am just i'm i'm freaking I'm 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 literally blown away. All right. 
So now I've hit the, uh, the, the little locator thing and I'm going to make it come to me now. So I'm going to say come to me, press and hold. There she goes, backing up. Please don't hit that light post. And you can see in the app, it's, it's showing the arrows, or it's showing the blue line of where it's going to go. And it, honestly, it's drawn a line right through that uh, curb. You better stop. And you see that curb, right? See, you ought not draw lines right through the curb like that. Turn, baby, turn! No road rash, please. All right, she worked it out. That, that wasn't, uh, you know, the most logical path by God, but. That's freaking curbside service right there if I've ever seen it. I, so, a couple things I, I'll tell you. Um, you know, I've seen the videos online and it's all cool and look i mean the car makes mistakes it's, it's not perfect this is a very early version i suppose of uh of what we can all expect but i'm literally blown away to see it in person to see what it just did i mean that's freaking it's like futuristic stuff man i mean it's it's pretty crazy i i don't know I, i'm not usually one to be lost for words but i'm a little lost for words here that uh that was freaking awesome uh so i'm going to uh hell i'm gonna do it one more time i'm gonna send it off in the distance somewhere so let's see all right i'm trying to show you this it's a little hard to all right so i'm gonna do summon i'm gonna do that all right and i i think sorry if i hit that yeah now i can send it to a target okay so I'm going to send it all the way back of the back as far as it can go. Okay. And now I'm going to tell it go to the target. And just like that, Taco is off on its third solo mission of its lifetime. I don't know. When you name your car Taco, is it a he or a she? I'll have to ask my uh, five-year-old. She's the one that named it. I'm guessing she would call Taco a she. Taco seems like a rather masculine name, but whatever. Anyway, Taco is on its third solo mission. I'm going to follow it so I can go. Well, hell, I'll just tell it to come back to me. I guess that's the whole point, isn't it? I don't know what it's pausing for. There it goes. I sent it all the way to the back of this parking lot. Alright, so far so good. It didn't hit the curb. Almost to its destination. It's got to get past that other curb. I don't know what the hell it's doing. Oh, it's going around. It's going around. Dude, that, I freaking, I'm sorry, I know I keep saying it. This is freaking mind-blowing. Summon complete. God! I mean, seriously, I, I didn't ever think I'd see the day where my car freaking go drive itself. All right, let's, uh, all right, so now I'm going to hit this button again, and I'm going to tell it. To come to Papa. Let's see. Please move into. Oh, I have to move up a little further. Um, it says I'm outside of the blue circle. All right. So it looks like I've got to get inside this blue circle. All right, that's good. Right here. Oops, I gotta hold it. So I'm gonna say, come to Papa. Come on, Taco. Here comes Taco, navigating this parking lot like it's been driving its entire lifetime. 
but it's only on its fourth solo mission. Please tell me you see that light. All right, you're good. Look at that. Staying out of the parking lines and everything. I guess it's stopping at the intersection. That is freaking amazing. Now it's going to make a hard left. All right, cut through the lines a little bit. Let's see if I want to see if it tries to get back in the parking lot, the normal. What's it going to do now? I'm sorry, y'all. This is some. This is some crazy stuff. I, like I said, it, until you see it in person, you don't understand the uh, the coolness and the enormity of of what you're witnessing. Um. It is just freaking amazing. All right, it's clearly making an attempt there to stay on the right side, on the on the right lane, and on the right side of the lane, the proper placement in the in the parking lot pathway here. Because when it turns, it's making a, a a sharp turn. It's coming right at me now. Summon complete. Uh, freaking that. That, that freaking amazing. I'm blown away. All right, I'm going to get my car to drive around for a little bit just to prove to my wife how much a geek I am. You know, new software comes out, I'll go and play in my car. But uh, hell, she's used to it. She knew what she was getting into when she married me. So I'm going to get back in the car and drive around a little bit. But guys, th this is freaking uh, truly amazing. I, I, I know I've said it a gajillion times. But I'm going to get my car and go play. Y'all have a nice day.